Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'll be reviewing a product that I bought from Amazon. That is HDMI capture card. Yes, I bought this HDMI capture card from Amazon, and I'll be doing a detailed review review about this product. So, watch this video till end, guys. You will get so many information, and I'll provide the timestamp in the description. And uh, please hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. So, let's get started. So hello guys, I got this uh, video capture HDMI from Amazon. It costed me around thousand eight fifty rupees. So this is the HDMI input and uh, this is the USB output. So the company claims that it is three point zero output and the maximum output resolution of this is ten eighty p sixty fps. Let's see if it's going to be ten eighty p sixty fps. And uh, it arrived in this box. Behind, I have given some instruction, connection, and specifications. And uh, it says that it's USB 3.0, and the MRP is 3,999. But I actually got it in around 1,850 rupees. And the contents of this box is this manual. So this manual comes with two languages: one is Chinese, and one more is English. Here, I have given some detailed uh, specifications about it. So the device compatible are the laptop, uh, PC, and all-in-one computer. Yeah. So the interface can be PS4, video camera, iPhone, Switch. You can even uh, use it as a webcam. I mean, you can connect the webcam and uh, you can connect it to the OBS and stream in your PC or laptop. So they have given some instruction on OBS plugin. Yeah, I'll I'll show you the complete setup of this uh, HDMI. So I'll be doing the live stream of PUBG using this HDMI cable. I'll show you how to set it up in OBS and stuff. And I'll tell you what cables and uh, how to do the setup for the live streaming of PUBG using this video capture. So guys, I had ordered this uh, product from the Amazon. So this says uh, USB 3.0. So in this, uh, th there are two versions of 2.0 and 3.0. As the 3.0 is the latest one, I had ordered this one. So this product even has one year warranty. If you have any defaults or uh, problems in the product, you can return it to the seller. And uh, it claims to have the input of maximum resolution up to 4K 30 Hz, and the output is uh, 1080p 60 FPS. And these are the contents of the box, guys. So, guys, to start the setup, we need certain cables. So, my device is OnePlus 7T. So, I need this uh, C2 multi-port output. So, I'm using this Spybox company. It claims to have one year warranty. And yeah, I forgot to tell you. This product um, says that it has one year warranty. It's made in China, though it says it has one year warranty. Yeah, I'll I'll show you guys this thing. Okay, I'll show you the uh, Amazon details, and I'll I'll give you the product link also. So yeah, let's come back to the streaming setup. So this is C to multi port. You have HDMI, USB, and uh, charging cable. So the one more product you need is uh, the HDMI out to HDMI out. So you will need all these three cables to start the setup. So guys, the setup of this is very simple. It's just plug and play. You have to connect one end of the HDMI to the video capture card and one more end to the 4K output. So you have to connect this USB to this SS port. It's at super speed. Connect it here and connect one more end of your C Type to your device. Right now I am. Uh, I'm recording with the same device, so I'll connect it and get back to you. Okay. So guys, I've made all the connection from this end to this end. So this is actually connected to my charging port right now. So guys, to set up the stream, actually I had made a video on the system itself. I had used the screen recorder, but unfortunately that didn't uh, record some main parts of the OBS. So I'll be using my camera itself. I'll show you like this. So I have already done this thing. Anyways, I'll do it again. So in the scene, click on the plus icon. Here, you name your scene. Scene, you name it anything. So I'll name it here PUBG. Okay. So click on OK. After clicking on OK, you are here. You can see the sources. So click on this plus icon. Then you can see so many uh, text here. So you can. Uh, Select the video capture device. So you can again rename this to anything. 
so i'll just click it okay after clicking okay here i have to select usb video one second here in in pubg stream it's already running so first let me delete this thing okay one second i'll close it again so in properties yeah you have to select usb video over here okay after selecting usb video here you can see resolution or fps type so i'll keep it as custom for now in resolution you have to select 1920 to 1080p for uh, 1080p resolution and uh, in fps you can see that the maximum fps of this is 30 so in 1080p guys you will get only 30 fps uh, but in uh, Amazon while purchasing it says that it's 60 FPS. Believe me, none of the capture cards below 5000 rupees are gonna give you 1080p 60 FPS. If there's something like that in description of any capture card, that is scam. Don't believe them. So in 1080p we'll get 30 FPS max, and in 720p we'll get 60 FPS max. So here it's 720p. In 720p we'll get 60 FPS max. Okay. you can change it in either ways and uh, just click on okay after clicking on okay so your uh, video is capturing your video of your device so you can uh, just drag this to adjust your screen size so you can see uh, the same video being captured because i am capturing the video through my device itself so again so now the video is captured now you want to uh, pass the audio through the capture card So you will again click on the plus icon. Then you will select uh, audio input capture. You should select audio input capture. You can name anything in that. Like uh, your only device audio will be passed through the capture card. So I'll just leave the name as it is and click OK. Then in device you have to select digital audio, USB digital audio. Okay. After selecting, okay, it's not selected. After selecting USB digital audio, click on the OK button. So your uh, audio input capture is selected. Let me show you. Yeah, this is your audio input capture. I wish I could show you this uh, thing moving, but uh, right now as I'm capturing my, I'm capturing the screen through my mobile itself. I can't show you this uh, triggering. Anyways, you have to set it up like this, and you have to click on the Start Streaming for streaming. but before that if you want to stream you have to again go to file and you have to do some changes over here if you want uh, the complete setup of the obs uh let me know in the comment section i'll make one more video of it too so you you you, sh you can uh, set up the basic uh, stream like this guys you can set it up your video capture like this let's go so guys this is the recording of the pubg gameplay at uh, 1080p 30 fps i'll make sure to give the drive the link of this time. in the description so that uh, the clarity is 100% to you guys so yeah enjoy this target down
is the recording of the PUBG gameplay at uh, 720p 60fps. So this uh, capture card records the PUBG at 1080p 30fps max resolution and uh, 720p 60fps. So guys, this is the review of this uh, you do like this video, hit that like button and subscribe to my channel guys. And my EC2 multiport should be like this time, so only there was some glitch and uh, problem in the audio. Nothing wrong with the HDMI, this is the problem with my EC2 multiport connector. So guys, this is the complete review. The clips will be available in the description, do check out the description and hit that like button and subscribe button guys. Thank you so much for watching.